members of council, Ashley Siles, 6549 Spanish Bay Drive. Um, as you remember from a month ago when we came in and kind of started talking about the opportunity we have on parcel 206, uh, we had said that a lot of it was a catalyst from a primary employer. And we actually have that primary employer with us here this evening, and they are ready to release um, a statement, and I'd like to invite them up to do so. Um, if you have any questions in terms of the development components, I'm happy to answer those, and then any questions directly related with the MFA. Um, why, who else is going to be using this parking garage to the point of making it justifiable for us to spend tax dollars, which is what we're doing in this MFA agreement, spending tax dollars to pay for a parking garage for private employees, for mm -hmm. employers. Now, so it's, sure. I so know it's for a, for a big thing, but mm -hmm. uh, tell me who else is involved in this and how does it, how do we justify up here using those tax dollars to spend on uh, a parking structure for private employers? So I would say that it's more than just Agrium, right? So there's about 200,000 other square feet of office space. And within that, about 60,000 square feet of that being dedicated to retail and restaurant. Um, and then you've got the multifamily component that's about 400 units. I think that there's a, such a diverse mix of uses. This isn't just about parking for employees that work on campus. So give me some specifics. What <clears throat> of this complex that this parking garage is going to service, <coughs> what percentage is uh, occupied by uh, Agrium and crop product, or just I guess just Agrium. Well, I think it'll so it'll range because I think what from day one it'll be a really low percentage. We haven't calculated that um, as they grow. Obviously, it would ebb and flow with their growth, um, but it's not something that we've looked at from a percentage basis. What I do know is that the parking garage can handle Agrium. It can handle another mixed-use building, of which two floors would be office and then retail. It handles 150 key hotel. Um, and then it handles guests of uh, the multifamily piece. So while we've programmed that with Walker and had parking studies done to understand the use and the ebb and flow and the hours of usage, um, I do know that the parking garage is substantial enough to handle that. How many parking stalls in the parking garage? Right now we're sitting around 1,000. 